Howdy y'all, Mr. Kazi here from beautiful Atascacita, Texas, and I'm here with another lesson in algebra, and today we're going to have a quick talk about intercepts. So get some graph paper, get a straight edge, and let's get started. You'll need to know the coordinate system, how to plot points, and how to graph a line. You will learn what intercepts are. You will learn how to find intercepts, and you will learn the importance of the intercepts. So first, what are intercepts? And we'll draw a little graph there. And intercepts are the points where a graph intersects an axis. And as you'll see here, we have an intersection here and an intersection here. There's our a y-intercept, and x is always 0. And there's our x-intercept, and y is always 0. Finding the x and y-intercepts. Find the x-intercept for the following equation. Now, the best way to find the x-intercept is to let y equal 0. And therefore, 2x uh, plus 4 times 0 equals 8. We just substitute the 0 in. And you'll note now, uh, we'll do some simplification. And we get 2x equals 8. Divide both sides by 2. And we get x equals 4. Therefore, the x-intercept is 4, 0. Find the y-intercept for the following equation. 2x plus 4y equals 8. This time, we'll just put in x as 0 because the x-coordinate is always 0 in the y-intercept. Substitute and simplify. Divide both sides by 4, and we get y equals 2. And therefore, our y-intercept is 0, 2. Now, what's really important about this whole thing is that you realize that our x-intercept always has a y-coordinate of 0. And the y-intercept always has an x-coordinate of 0. All right, let's graph using our x and y-intercept. We already calculated that the x-intercept was 4, 0, and the y-intercept was 0, 2. So let's plot those two points and draw a line through them. And if you'll note, uh, that line has a negative slope. So if we were to go through and calculate the slope, we would see that it was a negative slope. All right, recap y equals 0 in the x-intercept, x equals 0 in the y-intercept, intercepts intersect the axes, and can be used for graphing a line. All right, if you have any questions, send an email to mrkazi at mrkazi.com. Don't forget to look for other uh, videos on my YouTube.